I have a surprise for you. Oh, Chucky. <laughs> you guys in today's video today's video it is finally here as you can see from the thumbnail and the title of this video dun, dun, dun. I finally received my package I finally received my monster high Chucky dolls and it, like always I feel like I'm always the last one to receive stuff like this even when I pre-order things I don't know but it's finally here I finally got them and I can't wait so without further ado let's take a look and let's review them and see how good these Mattel Monster High Chucky dolls look like all right so as you can see I did get two because you're only able to pre-order two you were only able to pre-order two and I ended up getting two because why get one when you can get two <laughs> no but the reason why I actually ended up getting two is because one I want to keep it in its own original packaging and the other one I do want to take it out play with it and maybe display them outside of their box and just have one in their natural packaging forever and ever so yeah that's what we're gonna do we're just gonna open both of them up and see what they look like so i'm gonna start off with this one first all right so this is what they look like once again it's like they were two inside a box then they were inside a box now they're inside these papers <laughs> all right so let's open this up all right you guys so we have here both of the dolls and i have to say first impressions of the packaging without even looking at them just yet i have to say the packaging if you know me if you've been following me you know i'm a huge fan of packaging i know sometimes packaging doesn't really matter but to me when it comes down to stuff like this packaging is very very important and i have to say the packaging for this is just beautiful i like the size i think that it's a perfect size for what they are and yeah the packaging is just really it's very well done i feel like they could have did something a little bit better here in the back like I don't know it's not given what it's supposed to give but i do like the packaging from the side and the fronts i mean this is giving very much bright of chucky and yeah this is really really it's nice i will say that i really do like the packaging so the packaging gets an a plus no the packaging gets a b plus because the back is just a little too basic for my taste but it's still nice all right so now we're gonna open the fronts let's take a look at them and see what they look like whoa okay this is really like this is like you gotta push it down wow all right so okay so first impressions of the inside the packaging of the inside and the dolls i have to say i really i really like this i think it looks a lot better and a lot different in person than they do in pictures i don't know why I, I don't know for some reason i just like it better when i'm looking at it in person that's why I learned not to judge things by the pictures just yet because they do tend to look a little bit different in person and they definitely do look a lot different this is weird like me opening up barbies <laughs> okay this is really cool i like this okay so first things first i have to say i did like the dolls when i first saw them i thought they were really really cool i was really really excited for them and i'm still am i really really like everything but um looking at them right now looking at the dolls right now and just looking at the the tiffany one i have to say i do have some minor problems with the tiffany one and i will talk to you guys briefly about that now i do have to mention something i was looking on google and i was looking at different people's reviews on the other monster high dolls like the beetlejuice one and i think it was like the pennywise one and then just all the other ones that they released and looking at these i feel like this release or this collection is a little bit lackluster I don't know it just seems like it's missing something i don't know exactly what maybe it is the outfit of the doll maybe it is just i don't know but looking at people's beetlejuice dolls or like the beetlejuice doll and the pennywise one i feel like they did a lot more with those dolls than they did with this one especially when it came down to 
accessories like they could have did so much with accessories and or maybe even the outfit of the tiffany one like the chucky one looks good we know it's chucky it looks like chucky and a lot of people were complaining that the chucky one the chucky doll one was a girl but that's what monster high is it's just you know a bunch of uh girls the chucky one could have been a guy monster high doll does that make sense i don't know but that didn't happen so let's just let's just talk about what we do have here so yeah i do like I do like the Chucky one, but I do have a little bit of an issue with the Tiffany one. Now that I was really looking at everybody else's collections, like the Beetlejuice one, the Pennywise one, I feel like they did so much more with those dolls in those collections. Like they really did go all out with like the packaging. Not that the packaging for this one is simple and more plain, but I feel like it should have, I don't know, it should have been something bigger, <laughs> if that makes sense. I don't know, but what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take them out of the box and yeah, we're gonna take a closer look at the dolls. All right, you guys, so this is what the dolls look like outside of their box and I have to say, I actually do like how the dolls look. I think they're gonna look really, really cool displayed on display, but I have to say, yeah, I have to agree with what a lot of people were saying in the comments when these pictures were released, or I should say the promotional pictures for these dolls were released, that there's something off about the Tiffany. I feel like they missed the mark. This was a missed opportunity. I feel like they should have did something more with the dress. I don't really see Tiffany on here. Maybe if they would have added the the Tiff necklace, maybe different shoes. I I don't I don't know what this purse is. If they would have added maybe the voodoo for dummies or a candle to the hand, I think that would have been a little bit more practical. Or I think it would have worked out a little bit better if the dress would have been longer. If they would have got rid of the 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 hearts. I don't know, maybe I'm just nitpicking, but I feel like they did miss the mark with the Tiffany. Like, the shoes are nice, but this is not giving me Tiffany. When I look at this, it's not giving me Tiffany. I feel like it is Tiffany because it's standing next to a Chucky one, a Chucky doll, but just by itself, it's not giving Tiffany. The Chucky one is, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory it is chucky i like the hair i like the 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 outfits i do like the shoes but also i think that the chucky one should have had something like an accessory maybe a voodoo doll or i don't know the the little knife on top of the head is nice it's a really nice touch but i think it would have looked better if the doll would be able to hold it or something like that i don't know like i said maybe i'm just nitpicking but yeah i think they did miss the mark with the tiffany doll does that take away anything from the doll does it take away the beauty of the doll no it doesn't but it's just to me it's giving me a regular uh monsters high doll it's not giving tiffany but this is what we got and we're just gonna have to deal with it uh but yeah i do like the fact that they come with their own little stand they do they do come with this which is the mattel creation certificate of authenticity i will say that i do like the dolls i do like the packaging um i just wish they could have did something a lot better with the tiffany you know like the jacket <laughs> i don't know like the jacket i i don't know the jacket is not as bad maybe it's just their touch to their monster high line uh the hoop earrings ah i don't know let's just let's just leave it to what it is which is what we got and let's just appreciate it just a little bit more right let's just be a little bit more positive even though it's it's not giving tiffany but um uh, yeah i like the dolls perfect for the collection and um, I wish I did have all the other Monster High dolls like the Beetlejuice one, the twins from Shining, the Pennywise, the Bride of Frankenstein. I mean, they, they, I, I feel like I'm missing some, but I think the ones that I really, 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 really would have loved to get would have been the Beetlejuice one, the Pennywise one, and the twins from The Shining. The other ones, eh, whatever. I, I, really don't care for that but yeah i'm just glad that i did get these and i got two and i'm just gonna be able to post these in my collection or not not post but um display them in my collection and yeah you guys i don't know what do what do we think about these monster high chucky dolls do you guys like them were you able to get yourself a copy of the monster high dolls and if you did i would like to know your thoughts and your opinions on these dolls personally i'm gonna say i like them i'm gonna give them a b minus a nice collectible for your chucky collection if you like chucky stuff if you're obsessed with chucky and you collect like anything chucky like myself then i think this would be a perfect perfect 
collectible toy to have in your collection but yeah you guys that is pretty much it for today's video that is pretty much it for today's review as always let me know your thoughts and your opinions in the comments down below because your thoughts and your opinions do matter to me if this is your first time in my channel hi my name is edgar oh and i am obsessed obsessed with everything chucky i'm obsessed with everything in the horror world so if that sounds like you stick around click that subscribe button click that notification bell to get notified for every single time i upload but alright, you guys as always thank you for watching and i will see you on the next one until then i'll see you next time bye